breaking out the big guns. Barack Obama is on the campaign trail to support his former vice president. Speaking in Michigan, the traditionally left-leaning state, which Hillary Clinton narrowly lost in 2016, Obama argued that his successor was irresponsible and unfit for the job. I understand this is a president who wants full credit for the econ economy he inherited and gets zero blame for the pandemic he ignored, but the job doesn't work that way. Tweeting at the TV doesn't fix things. Making stuff up doesn't make people's lives better. You've got to have a plan. You've got to do the work. Donald J. Trump. Meanwhile, Donald Trump concentrated on Pennsylvania, holding four rallies there this Saturday. The swing state is a major natural gas producing area. Trump has repeatedly said that his rival would abolish the entire U.S. oil industry and ban fracking, claims Joe Biden has repeatedly denied. Moments ago, I signed an order to protect Pennsylvania fracking and block any effort to undermine energy production in your state. Trump continues to hold large gatherings of often maskless supporters, ignoring social distancing measures. The U.S. president has been keen to avoid focus on his handling of the coronavirus pandemic. The country recorded just over 100,000 new cases on Friday, a world record. Polls currently give his rival Joe Biden the upper hand, but Trump is predicting another surprise victory for himself.